been quite the season so far for Jerron Williams, both on and off the court. Amongst the many milestones he achieved in the last seven days, here's another one. Meet our Athlete of the Week. One look around the gym at East High School, and you'll see history. Not just in the banners they fly, but in the players, too. Case in point, former Thunderbird, now UAA Seawolf, Jerron Williams. Coach Martin actually sent us a text saying all the alumni needs to come to the game, come support the young guys, you know, just where, where it all started. It's amazing to be back here with the family and the team. After helping the Thunderbirds to four straight 4A tournament appearances and three years away at Spokane Community College, the Anchorage native was ready to come home playing for a team that had wanted him from the start. They were recruiting me a lot during high school. I just kind of wanted to see what it was like in Washington. But then coming home was always big for me with my family, you know, being back with my friends and just, just being able to play in front of the home crowd was big for me. His performance on the court, that's been pretty big too. Being named GNAC Player of the Week just a few days earlier. And it was just a big time to see all the work that I put in, you know, just, just show on the floor. Now over four years since donning the red and blue, Williams is looking to the past to inspire the future. I remember when I was growing up, you know, I always had people who I looked up to, like like Desmond Johnson, Marquise White, people who came before me and how they showed love. So I'm trying to do the same thing. And sometimes that means showing tough love, too. I like to give the young guys a hard time, um, but that's just me pushing them. You know, I, I see a, a lot of bright futures in them that they might not even see in themselves yet. So I'm, I'm really hoping that they stick down to it. Williams and the rest of the Seawolves roster will be back in action January 6th. They seek their first conference win of the season against Fairbanks.